Hey guys, I am home, back to the normal grind of everything. Um, so yeah, it's been hot here lately. It's been in the 90s for the last like five, five days or so. Since so when we left for Miami. Um, it's just, just crazy how hot it is here, but not, nowhere near as bad as it was hot wise and humid at Miami. I think anything could beat that. It was so hot and humid, even at night, like nine o'clock at night, it would be still like 100% humidity. It will be a feel, the feel like temperature would be like 100 still at night, 11 o'clock at night. The night when we went out to the clubs and I had to wear jeans, I was dying. I was so, I was sweating like crazy. It's, it, it's been crazy how different it is all the way down there. It's so tropical down there. It's a lot of humidity and stuff. So, and it rained. It rained, I think, every night too. But during the day, it was nice and dry, except the first day. So, here's, I'm going to give you guys an update on everything, everything good on here. Um, Blueberries are pretty much done. Raspberries are pretty much done. I'll give you guys a nice tour of what's happening here. Cause it's been like what, a week or so. Orange tree still growing out of control. It's doing good. We have a pine plant looking good here. This is the one that survived the storm. And then when that orange tree fell on it, cactus. Looking good. This part's bigger than that part. Let me show looking good. The bad news is that we did lose the, lime, the baby lime on here. I can no longer find it. Something might happen. Might be another storm where we lost it. That's a shame. But at least we're getting closer each year. Pomegranate looking good. Nice size baby one right there. Passion fruit looking good. It's just it's grown wherever the way it wants to. It's not even going the right direction. I got water some of these plants. It's been hot here. Normal strawberry plant. This is a red strawberry. Looking good there. Pot and berry picked like one yesterday. So that's doing good. Again there. Um, if you guys watch in the backyard, the house that we're staying up. Um, they had a giant one, like 12 foot tall, it's not taller than that, of the same plant. So that's what it's going to look like eventually, someday. But probably not that tall, because it's not in Miami. So it won't be outside or in the ground for the whole year. But they, I didn't realize how big they actually get. But hopefully we'll get in some cool flowers in the next year or so. And that's really cool, though. I wasn't expecting to see out there, but then again, it is kind of the same, temperature, same kind of weather as Hawaii. In a way, onions are looking good, looking big. Oh, I'm gonna go this way first. Cactus are all looking good. Definitely loving being in the ground. Um, yesterday I picked the first fig. I was taking a break yesterday for filming, so I didn't record it. It was really good. The first fig I had since I think fourth grade, which is back in like 2003, 2004 ish. It's been a while. This is the next one coming up. We have, we have a bunch on here. Not bad at all for the first year. Let's go this way. I think it might rain today. A chance. They said like isolated. This being, these bands are doing really good now. They're definitely a little bit taken off. They're doing good. Yeah, I'm really happy everything's doing. Especially the, the day we left, it like stopped raining. Like it used to rain every day. And now it just was really, really hot every day. So here's more over here. Here's some, these are the peppers we didn't use. These are the ones from Italy. We might actually get some peppers in there too. So, it's kind of funny. We weren't really planning on getting anything from that. We got a couple blue blueberries left here. That's not really too much. I'll probably pick the rest of those today and then take netting off. Probably by the weekend. These ones are all done too. This band tree is looking good. Getting taller, at least opening up. But it's doing really good. So we're gonna go check out, we're gonna go down here, check out sunflowers and um, check out the baby birds. They should be getting, leaving any time, pretty much they're big enough. So here are the sunflowers. So far it's looking good. Didn't even send them out. Cause they really don't have to. They're looking really good. Here's a garden over here. 
We have a lot of baby can't open watermelon grow. I don't know what the stuff is, the white stuff on the leaves are. It seems like we have an issue with that. They're doing really good. Peppers are doing crazy. We did not fly out of my house, of course. It'd be cool to have a, a top view of my house. There's many plants that are growing that I control right now. As you can see, we picked one. Picked two last night. But yeah, tomatoes are starting to come in now. Look at this. Holy crap, look at this bunch right here. Damn. There's a whole, whole big bunch of tomatoes there. Oh, we got one of the early girls growing. Turning red down there. The broccoli's doing good. The cane's doing good. The new part garden's doing real good. So we're, gonna add, we're still gonna add a bunch of compost over here. I think we're gonna focus most of the compost over in this area because it's brand new. But yeah, compost is getting there too. Grapes are starting to ripen as you can see up here. I picked a couple yesterday. I don't know what you guys see, but they're starting to turn red. These are red grapes over here. And then these are green ones. This year we don't have any green grapes. Sadly. Here's some more mint. The mint's dried and I gotta show you the bag of mint we have inside the house, which it only takes like a week to grow if you have it out in the sun. Especially since it's been hot too. Okay, before I show you guys the baby robins, we have so many blackberries in here I have to go get today. I might just wait till, till, wait till later. And like I said, uh, raspberries are pretty much done. Done for the year. They, look how tall they've gone. They've gone. They've exploded over the summer. Definitely, definitely had a good year for them, for sure. Blueberries, they really good too. Darn. Okay, back down the hill, I'm gonna show you guys the onions and uh, the baby robins. Hopefully they're still there, but they might have flew away already. Hey, yeah, I'll be off, I'll be back kind of funny, because of course if I wanted to do a video, they were already fly away. So here are the onions and blueberry, onions and baby robins. Onions are doing, onions are growing out of control right now. They're doing really good. Here are all the sunflowers, leftover sunflowers in here. I'll make sure. Hi, hi Robins. Oops, my camera stopped. Didn't realize it, but here. What is it? Baby Robins. Doing really good. It should be out any day. They're so big now. Very big. I hope you hopefully you guys can see that. They should be out here any time now. Yeah, I'm gonna let them. Well, I'm gonna step away from there in case the mama robin comes back to feed them. But they're doing, doing really good. Um, they hatch, they're really, really tiny. They grow so quick. They're really tiny when they first hatch. Um, back a couple years ago, I rescued one with found an egg. So I've been in and hatched it out. It lasts a while. It hatched out and then it's just to make it have, I had kind of a rough start. Um, Cause the egg was cool for a while. So it was already a week to start. So yeah, well, at least I tried, it's barely nothing. So I'm gonna go back inside, it's hot out here right now, and see what's going on. Cause I gotta finish up with a video, which should be out today by one, which you'll see it tomorrow, it should be out already. So I got a couple things to do, so I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, so I'm back inside. Uh, I'm just filling out now some stuff for, for school in the fall, I'm going over some emails for, um, See what's going on, see if I got anything important for my class or anything. I already got my whole class scheduled, but I think I need one more class. Uh, I'm trying to go for, I'm gonna go for five this semester, so I need a lab, uh, I need a science lab class. So I might see what kind of options I have here, even though it might be kind of late, so I don't know what kind of options I'm gonna have here. Um, but um, yeah, so I got an email from my roommate, so I'm texting him. Um, just to try to get to know everybody, even though my roommates keep switching, but I don't think it's gonna be that switching that much now since we're like, what I'm like. A little over a month away from um, all moving in, um, 
So yeah, definitely gonna be interesting as hell once August 24th comes around and it's my last day here. Um, it's gonna be very interesting. I don't know. I don't even know what to expect. I'm just gonna be, I'm just gonna have a good time. I'm just gonna enjoy enjoy my last few years. Um, make a lot of new friends. It's gonna pretty much be like how the college vlog originally started. Um, but it's just kind of kind of the same and kind of completely different at the exact same time. So I signed up for like all the intramural stuff so I can easily do that whenever it happens, meet new people and stuff. So I'm doing that. Um, now I'm filling a bunch of stuff out. And just going over stuff. Uh, I got to fill a lot of like emergency contact stuff. Um, get anything what happened. So yeah. So I'm going to pretty much be doing that for much a good part of the day. Just getting everything ready. I can't believe we're like, what, 30, I think we're like 32, 33 days away. I don't even know what today's date is um, from me moving in up there. Definitely going to be an adventure, without doubt. It's the 20th. So, a month and four days. Um, definitely going to be very interesting. <laughs> living with people, it's like living with Josh and Mark and them. Um, but for like a couple months at a time. So yeah, gonna be very interesting having three roommates, having four people live in a room. It's gonna be an adventure, I can tell you that. So we'll see. We'll see how everything goes. Um, gonna make for some good vlogs, make for shit a weekend and stuff too. So it's if, definitely gonna be an adventure, I think. And Josh and I'm all gonna come visit me and stuff. So I'm gonna have all of them up here on weekends. So this week, this week I'm here, but not here, here kinda. So I don't really know what to expect. It's, Gonna be definitely different for sure. So yeah, I'm gonna go fill all that stuff out. Um, I'll check back with you guys when I'm done. Fire going. Have a friends coming over. This is only the second fire of the year. It's crazy because this time last year had like at least eight. So we got the fire pit going over here. Got all stuff moved around the deck here. Nice sunset in the background. We got the beer pong table over here. Got some glow sticks for them. Put inside the cups. To do yourself awesome, make your own awesome beer pong table video coming soon. Um, I want to wait to come on your how long, how long they last for. Stop telling me. There's 12 in here, each of a color. All the cups over here, cups over here. I might have enough, I might put some around the border too. Make it really, really cool. Especially at night because it's going to get loud and my parents' room is right there. I'm going to move the table. Out to here. Instead of last year, we had all of our phones out, like a giant spotlight, so we could play a game. Um, this would be a lot easier. Uh, with the cups glowing. This could be pretty interesting. Everyone's coming over. I think a lot of people start work and stuff. So Friday night, you gotta enjoy. It's summertime, and we might be sharing a special announcement tonight too. But it's not 100% yet. It's gonna happen, but it could be a coming soon. Um, I think someone's here. Uh, and it could be coming soon announcement. So stay tuned for that. I think it's Josh. Look who it is. Back from Miami. <laughs> like I haven't seen Josh forever. Hi Josh. Here we're trying to get the speaker working. If it works, this fire is hot. And it's also like 90 degrees right now too. But everyone's just slowly making their way over. People are changing. Coming from work. It'll be a little bit before everyone comes over. It's not, it's not even dark yet. This is the good thing about summer is it gets dark so late. Like what? What time is it right now? Like nine something? Nine thirteen right now. It's still pretty much daylight still. Okay, so we're trying to get the speaker to work. Come back to you guys in a little bit. Check this out. Got the cups over here. Not all the yellow ones worked. Or green ones. I don't know what they are. Not all of them work, so. That'd be cool we'd have all the cups filled. That's really cool. Look at that. Steve packed and had a throw a party. We're just waiting for everybody to come over. Everybody's getting off work and stuff, getting ready. You wowed. Man, it's really dark with the cups here. We really put a light on? Hey, what? <laughs> Hello, s'mores. My stomach's feeling funky. This is s'mores. Hey, you guys coming over? Oh, you yeah, can turn the light off. Playing pong ball. Yeah. Okay, but why do you think that's that? Turn that off, Steven. Yeah. I wish. They need to light that one right there, too. Hey, Steve, does that light over there turn on, too? Yeah, I think they all do. Steven. No, no, I think we're keeping the lights off. Oh, there's two cups in there. Yeah, we are the thunder. Yeah. 
Where about that? We're gonna have to go to the car. It's fine. If we fill a drop, then we'll move. <laughs> and, and the fight starts again. <laughs> okay, wait, I'm confused. Why did they bounce it off the table? Well, because we're allowed to. You bounce off the table, you guys got But I got a cup. Okay, bye. <laughs> they get too tough. No. Whatever they want. No, John. Uh, oh! <laughs> <laughs> that was so awkward. Yeah. How's that ACL? <laughs> oh my god. Leg. My leg. <laughs> Oh no. Got it. Got it. Oh. Come on, Ryan. Pay attention, please. Watch out. Too, <laughs> come on, Ryan. Pay attention. Ooh, oh, get a ball back. Nice. Get him back. Ryan, come on. Oh, get him back. Get your head in the game. Come on, guys. Get your head What's in the game. What's happening over there? <laughs> Go ahead. Why did I jump? <laughs> wow. I airballed that fuck out of that. There we go, Kyle. There we go. Um. <laughs> Is that thunder? No, I can hear I it thunder like it. Wait, it's fine. Okay, okay, okay. You guys good? <laughs> Who's next to challenge? Undefeated 3 0. Yeah. Mark, you're playing. Because like like <laughs> I'm eating uh -oh. it. Rachel's about to have Oreo up in her teeth, up in her braces. I mean, you yeah. can just lick pee. it, bro. You got to <laughs> up in her pee. Like, oh, that's nasty. <laughs> Rachel, are you okay to drive? No, Ryan. <laughs> Should Ryan drive? No, I'll drive. No one's riding my dude. <laughs> You're a bitch. You're a bitch. I know. Slut? Slut fuck? <laughs> Lesbian slut fuck? Yeah, coming from the queen.